What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. It's Drew Gray here. And in this video, I wanted to talk to y'all more about some manifestation tips and also how to get out of a depressive sad state. So this video is all about how to be happy. So my first tip for getting out of a sad depressive state is I want you to know that you have a choice You have a choice to choose happiness to be sad You have a choice to sit in bed all day and to not get up You have a choice to get out and to try to live your life and to try to be happy So understand that you have a choice to be happy So choosing to be happy leads me to my second tip Second tip is to watch happy funny things Watch happy funny movies I know when I'm sad, I like to watch sad movies and then I stay sad, I stay in a sad, depressive state. But to flip that and to change that is to watch happy things. You can't be sad and laugh at the same time. It just is contradicting, you can't do that. So my third tip is to be around people that are happy, that are fun, that are loving, that will support you. Be around people that are there to lift you up. You don't wanna be around negative people, people that gossip, people that are always just talking about woe is me, what's wrong with their life. You want people that are happy. You want people that are looking at the brighter side, who are encouraging, who are optimistic. So surround yourself with people who are also happy. Tip number four is to go out and live your life. I know, I know, I know it's difficult and I know you wanna stay home and you wanna stay in bed all day. Trust me, I have been there, I have done that. But then it gets to a point where I'm like, you know what, I'm tired of being sad, I'm tired of like feeling low. I'm tired of making myself feel like this. So go out, be with your friends, go out, be with your family, go to a movie, go um, go work out, go take a class, go do something productive to get your state in a higher frequency, get your energy in a higher, higher frequency. Because when you are low and your energy is low and you're sitting in bed, energy goes where energy flows. So it's gonna stay low. If you are up and out and active, your energy is gonna rise, therefore your demeanor is gonna rise, your feelings are gonna rise, everything is just going to elevate. Another tip that I have is to read encouraging, happy, just life-changing books. Read inspirational books. I know that for me, that's what I did. I would stay up all night just reading things, watching inspirational things when I was sad and when I was depressed. So understand that you can change your whole life. You can change your whole state. You can change exactly how you feel. It's just up to you to want to change. No one can make you change. No one can help you. It's still you that has to do the work. Another tip that I have is to actually change your physical appearance. So I know a lot of people when they are in a rut or when they're stuck, they work out. They work on themselves physically. Change your hairstyle. Get a bang. Um, get a bob. Dye your hair. Men, shave your head off, grow a beard, like do something different. There are so many things that you can do to change your physical appearance and to just change your surroundings. When you change yourself, everything around you starts to change as well. I know I touched on this before, but watching funny things and laughing really does help your energy and help your state of being. So when you are happy, and you're laughing, you cannot be sad or you cannot be angry. It just, it doesn't work. If you're laughing, you're happy. And last but not least, my ultimate tip that I give in pretty much every single video is to give gratitude. When you are giving gratitude and you're writing down things you're grateful for or saying things that you're grateful for, that elevates your state of being as well. That elevates your frequency. You can't be angry and be giving gratitude. It just, it doesn't work. So when you raise your frequency and you start to write down things you're grateful for, ultimately your state of being becomes more relaxed, becomes more peaceful, becomes more happy. I hope you guys enjoyed this tip. I am speaking firsthand. Um, I am a credible source when it comes to trying to be happy or searching for happiness because I've been in a depressive, sad state and it was ugly, it was bad, it was just not good. And I know so many people around me were trying to help me and encourage me, but it was me that had to change. It was me that had to want to change and to want to do the work to get better. So, no one can help you but yourself. 
people can try to help, people can be there to support you, but ultimately it's you that has to change and want to be happy. So I want you all to know that you do not have to stay in a depressive, sad state. You don't have to be angry and upset and sad all the time. There are ways to get better and to help change your frequency. So I hope these tips help. Please, please, please try these things out and I promise you, you will start to see a change in your life. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thank you, comment, subscribe, like, all of those things, and I'll see y'all in the next one.